So this is about adaptations of different organisms depending on where they live, their habitat. So you need to know about two different organisms. The first one is the polar bear. The polar bear lives in the Arctic where it's cold and it's icy. So it has five adaptations you need to know about. It has small ears to prevent heat loss. It's also got a thick coat also to prevent heat loss. It also has a white coat so it can camouflage and it has sharp claws and ah, sharp teeth so it can attack its prey because it's a predator. Lastly, it's got big wide feet to spread its weight on the ice. That's the polar bear. You also need to know about an animal called the tube worm that lives under the sea in places called hydrothermal vents. Hydrothermal vents are deep under the sea so there's high pressure, it's wet um, and it's actually quite hot by a hydrothermal vent but nearby it can be quite cold so there's a big change in temperature around a hydrothermal vent. What adaptations do the tube worm have? Well, they have no eyes because it's dark down there so instead they've got very sensitive little tentacles. They're also covered in a layer of bacteria that helps uh, insulate it against the big changes in temperature. The last thing we need to know about the tube worm is that it's got a very strong body coating to protect it against the high pressure of all that water. So that's the tube worm and where it lives in the hydrothermal vent.